Jeez, man, the latch is melt locked. How the hell did he get through? I think he ran through. You can do that? It's only one way to find out. Nelson's a bioterrorist, too. Wait, he's not. Fine, go. Vince. Good to know. Wow, that should have hurt. Betty! Where are you, Betty? I don't want to spoil the surprise. Almost there, Betty! You Don't lady. stay away from me! Stop! Stop. Nelson! I was just trying to create a diversion. I didn't know anybody was in you here. You did this to me! You're a conduit? Uh. Betty, I'll explain later, but you gotta get out of here now. Good, I'm gone. Not until you fix this first! I spend most of my life behind bars. It's easy enough to bust out. You just gotta wait for that golden opportunity. When I got my powers, hell, I was unstoppable until the D.U.P. caught up with me. Yeah, they got a special hole they like to toss folks like me in. Figured out a way to bind us all up so we couldn't use our powers. That also meant they had to feed us, wash us, even wipe our goddamn asses. That's no way for a man to live. There's no way. They had this red-headed bitch there, really in the needles and scalpels. She called what she did to me tests. But if you do enough time, you learn a few tricks. You just gotta be patient. Sooner or later, they'll screw up. They always do. You maybe see something or you hear something, learn things you weren't supposed to know. So when that bitch put the three of us in that wagon, I knew what was coming. A golden opportunity. around inside my head. It was me? I thought that was you. You saw it, right? That D.U.P. prison. If she catches you, that's where you're going. Wait, wait, wait! I'm warning you, kid. Back off! We're not going anywhere. 
until you fix this! Listen, I don't know what happened, but you better be ready to disappear! Why? You're a conduit now, kid! A bioterrorist! Welcome to the world of Run For Your Life! And that's what I aim to do, even if I gotta go through you! Me, you owe me! Ain't listening! Back the hell off! Not going anywhere until you fix this! This ain't something that can be fixed! Then... At least show me how to control it. Ain't got time! Stay your face coming! And she knows I'm on to her plan! Two, three minutes diversion tops. I gotta get now. Ain't going back to Curtin K. Yeah, well, whoever's coming is coming for you, man, not me. You've been seen, son. Folks here know about you. And she's got a way of making people talk. Good luck, kid. Oh, hell no. No way I'm gonna die in a fish guttery. Listen, <laughs> you just let me go. Just let me walk away. Nobody's ever got to know about any of this. Wait a minute! Stop! Let's talk about this! Just let me go! Oh, Henry. I am so very disappointed in you. Well, we got him, right? I, uh, flushed that mean old conduit for you. Good job. Their cause, you're not a traitor, are you? I, uh, I, I try not to be. <laughs> You seem nervous. No, I'm not nervous. <laughs> it's been my experience. There are only two reasons for people to be nervous. Either they're cowards, or they have something to hide. Well, you know, I also get nervous around pretty girls. You were in there with that bioterrorist for some time. Did he share anything with you? Um, share... Did he say anything to you? Share any of his ramblings about conspiracies? Oh, um, no, he didn't... he didn't share anything. Good. That's good to hear. You see, we are engaged in a life-and-death war with these bioterrorists, and it's my job to do whatever it takes to ensure that we win that war. What? Well, that's kind of funny because <laughs> aren't you a bioterrorist too? Okay, okay, okay. Yes, I am. Sometimes you have to fight fire with fire. And it's clear now that you're not a coward, which means there's something that you're not telling me. Well, what, are you, what are you doing? You can't do this, you crazy! I've got rights! And I have the legal authority to suspend those rights whenever I feel it's necessary. Like now, for instance, I'll ask again what happened in there. And I will tell you again. God! <sighs> <sighs> I'm told that hurts. Maybe I know what happened no, in there. No, Betty, don't. So. Really? Still nothing. Well, 
Unless you decide that you do have something to tell me. I'll go chat with that nice old lady. But you should know, concrete is especially hard on brittle bones. And if she doesn't talk, I'll just move on to the next one, and the next, until I find someone who does. So do you have something you want to tell me? Or do you prefer that I move on to your friends here? Which one? Turn yourself in. Piss off. Then I have no further use for you. <laughs> Hope you're not as stubborn as that one. Are you, Betty? Yeah, I'm told that hurts. How does that work? Longhouse into a hospital? How long have I been out? Did anyone do this? How many people did she hurt? And no one could stop her? Oh my god. Betty. Augustine wasn't bluffing her. Well, no one here was going to turn you in to protect themselves. We're Comish. We take care of our own. <laughs> I 
I guess I did the right thing. Can you imagine what that bitch would have done to me if I'd actually talked? Probably the same thing she did to everyone else in this room when you didn't. Do me a favor and um, tell everybody else that uh, I said uh, thanks for taking one for the team. Delson! Whoa. <laughs> Damn it, I thought we were gonna lose you there. Well, concrete the legs? It's gonna take more than that. Oh. Glad to see fast healing seems to be a part of your new, uh, thing. Uh, speaking of which, um, the craziness with the hands, is that gone? Yeah, I don't know, man. There's no smoking in the longhouse, remember? <laughs> right. And I wouldn't want to get in the way of anyone's recovery. What did it take? Nelson, these, these people aren't getting any better. They're dying, man. You don't know that. No, but the doctors who came through here when you were out, they do. And they said that... They said the only way those shards are coming out is the exact same way they went in. What? But that, that was Augustine and her concrete power. And screw it, man. Looks like you and me are going to Seattle and we're gonna go get her. Whoa, 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 wait, what? You think you're just gonna charm her into coming back here with you? Come on, man, I know you took a bump to the head, but you two didn't exactly hit it off last time you were together. Reggie, I did this. And I gotta fix it. No, damn it, Dustin, you just got back on your feet. I know you want to help, but the doctors have already said the only, the only way it's getting out is with the same power. I get it. Which means we don't actually need Augustine. We just need her power. <laughs> okay, now you've lost me. I'm a goddamn power sponge, remember? If I got smoke, why can't I get concrete? <laughs> yeah, but what, what if smoke was just a fluke, huh? I mean, think about it. You'd have to go through, uh, what, a thousand DUP guys just to get to her? Yeah, probably something like that. I'll explain in the truck. What truck? I don't have a truck. I... That's my truck. All right, I got this whole thing figured out, okay? We, we hit the town, we load up at the all-you-can-leech condo at Power Buffet, you maybe swing by the Space Needle, always wanted to see it, and then we're back home to save some lives. You do realize when we hit the town, there's a fair Shut chance the town is going to, you know, hit back? What does that even mean? It means that Seattle has half a million people that aren't exactly thrilled about the bioterrorists that are already there. You think they're going to welcome you? Wake up, man. Don't worry, Dell. all right? We're gonna fix this thing. I'm gonna find you a cure. A cure? But shooting smoke out of your fingertips isn't exactly normal, man. Just because it's not normal doesn't mean that it needs a cure, okay? Van Gogh wasn't normal. Gandhi wasn't normal. Yeah, but people weren't scared of Gandhi, all right? People are afraid of bioterrorists. They're freaks. See, that's pre-programmed bull... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit. Great. Huh. Well, looks like we're walking the rest of the way. <laughs> Walk? What? Yeah. Where are you going? Hey! Damn it. Holy crap, would you look at this? Uh, look, you know, if you're having second thoughts, I completely... Are you kidding me? This is amazing! 
This is destruction. This is self-defense, man. The roadblock was set up to attack them. Yeah, because they're bioterrorists. Well, it didn't stop them, and it's not gonna stop this bad boy either. Man, this is like... Oh, this must be the mothership. One punch the hey, chit. Are you okay? Okay. I'm better than okay, man. I think I picked up a new trick. Has it looked better, Eliza's? Yep. Definitely new and improved. Jelson, this is not improved, man. We're trying to fix the problems you already have, not add new ones. What do you think? Augustine is just sitting on her ass? I gotta power up if I'm gonna go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Concrete Queen. Hey, I'm hoping to avoid that. Listen, there might be another way that we can get to Augustine. What other way? I, what other I way? I have a few connections in Seattle. Right, some in the police force. No, if no, we no, 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 us... no. This is not the point where Reggie swoops in and makes everything all right. Well, this is not your problem to fix. It is mine. Oh, is somebody there? Can you hear me? There. Perfect. You want to go help somebody? Go save damsel in distress. Anyone? It's not. Please. All right. Fine. We both go. Come oh, on. no, 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 no. Eliza is in okay, T watching. Catch up with you in a minute. Is he? All right, but don't go anywhere. And for God's sake, don't touch anything! I'm gonna touch everything. Hello. You're up first, little guy. We're still using that. Oh, maybe I just need to refill the smoke tank. You're up first, little guy. Yeah, they're kind of cute. Good to go. Okay, yeah, that could definitely be habit forming. Man, once we hit the city, I'm gonna have to keep an eye out for more of those things. Fail. Well, guess if they're not going to land, I'll have to take them down. Dude, you will not believe what that beeping was. Just get up I... here, okay? I found a bus full of relief workers that's stuck. I'm trying to convince them to just abandon the bus. I don't want to leave all the medical supplies on the bus. Just tell them to hold on. I'll get the bus unstuck. Nelson, I know what you're thinking, and don't. Dude, I just took out a fleet of quadcopters. I think I can dig out a bus. This is going to take forever. There's got to be a faster way. I do not yeah, I'm sorry, Reg. Can't hear you over the sound of my heroics.
This is gonna take forever. There's gotta be a faster way. I am unstoppable! Delson, I told you not to... That's sorry, Reg. Can't hear you over the sound of my heroics. Delson, I'm not... Ah, lost you. Have to hit the mute button. Okay, looks like the rest of the way is clear. I'm gonna ride this baby straight into Seattle. WTF. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Hello? Hey, Delson, we got a problem. Some of the people on the bus, they saw you doing your super thingy to clear the way. And? And they're afraid of you. What? Look, I told you, man. Bioterrorists aren't especially popular. So what, am I like Rosa Parks and they want me to sit on the back of the bus? No, they want you to sit outside the bus. Look, they don't want you in here, right? They said if you come on, they're gonna get off. Then let them walk. I don't care. You think I can't take this door down? You are not gonna do that. These people have never seen anything like you before, and they're scared, right? And I can't blame them. Says he's gonna break down the door. Go. Sir, just give me a second. Look, just let me run them across the bridge. I'll come right back for you, all right? It'll take five minutes. Man, I can't let you on the bus. Five minutes. Uh -huh. Listen, just switch on the GPS tracking on your phone in case we get separated. Oh, you mean like right now? Attention. The scheduled decommission of the 520 bridge by order of the DUP will begin shortly. All vehicles and individuals are ordered to... Huh. That sounds like useful information. Delson, I got the aid workers across the DUP. Clearing the bridge. Coming back for you, so... Is you there? What's going on? Hello? Hey, hey, you guys need any help? Oh, shit. A bioterrorist. Hey, hey, it's one of those it's freaks. It's okay. Whoa, no, 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 no. Ah. Oh, this fast healing stuff is going to come in real handy. Shoot me like that? Big mistake. Should have said please. Attention. The scheduled decommission of the 520 bridge by order of the DUP will begin immediately. There will be no further event. 
Oh, this is gonna suck. <laughs> what the hell just happened? <coughs> what is going on, Freddy? Oh man, answer me! Oh my god. This was a bridge. I'm coming, Reg. Core relay, work your magic. For the shot. Okay, Cosmos, keep them coming. <laughs> okay, okay, easy. Kind of a bad time, Betty. You took off before I was through talking to you. Well, you know, I had, I had plans. I heard you and Reggie were heading to Seattle of all places. Really gotta go, Betty. Love you. <laughs> Hold still. Hang in there, Delta. Almost across. Double bridge?
the bus. Reggie! Reggie! Set up pitching army, huh? Delson! All right, all right, all right, come on. I got it. Thanks for the hand. Huh. Check it out. Wow. Seem to be getting the hang of your uh, new symptoms, right? <laughs> of course, the only downside being that. Uh... Nope. I can't think of anything. This is pretty freaking awesome. <laughs> really? No downside? How about those heavily armed guys over there now want to hurt you real bad? That a downside? Yeah. Now look, for all we know, we may be able to pass you through their security, you know, because you're not a normal viral terrorist. So... Normal? No, no, if you mean by normal, you know, the sheep that they try to line up so that they can probe them. No, Reggie, I'm not normal. And did you see what I did on that bridge? You I could did. take these Look, guys. Let's just see if we can sneak you through their checkpoints first, all right? It'll make getting around the city a lot easier. Okay, fine, fine. We'll do it your way. I'll settle. Listen, promise me you'll play it cool up ahead. Hey, they used to call me Mr. Cool. No one has ever once called you that. Ever. Are you really worried about this? These DUP guys may not have the same level of power that you, that natural bioterrorists have, but the government infused them all with enough to still do some serious damage. Well, you have just officially ruined my Seattle vacation. How long did you say I was out for? One week. Wow. That means the DUP put all of this up to... Yep. Oh, they've kept busy. Once we're through, I'll check with a couple of my cop buddies and try and get access to the police databases. In the meantime, I need you to just lay low. I might spook them if I show up with a bioterrorist. Okay, boss man. This is a registered firearm. I'm a police officer. Of Jeez, won't let me on his bus, won't let me meet his friends.
got separated. You okay? Me? I'm fine. Dandy. But just like you said, laying low. Just keep laying low. I'll call when I've got some. Help them. Dude. Everybody going. In Ghana, sat up watching. I'm not watching anymore. Immediately, or we will. Fine. Hey, what the hell, man? You're supposed to be protecting them from me! Nelson, I got access to the Seattle Police Database. Turns out, the DUP has eyes and ears everywhere. Well, just gouge out their eyes and slice off their ears. All right, I've got you on my GPS. Not far from one of their mobile command centers. If you can shut that down, it'll limit their ability to track your movements. Mobile command center, got it. So what exactly does one of those look like? Well, it should be a large, heavily armored mobile unit with side ports and major communication gear on top. All right, I think I see it. A uh, badass RV with lights and metal crap on top. Now, if you blow out enough of those, the core should overheat and be exposed. Okay, blow out the panels, got it. Man, that feels good.
Can't you mix up karma? Can't you mix up karma? center and destroy it. Should make things a little easier. Find the main power core? It should be on top. I can't watch, bro. Oh, you must be back up. I think I prefer the smaller guys. They are really stepping up their game. Definitely prefer the smaller guys. Short and sweet. Emo Massa Pacifist. I'm a Maso pacifist. Hey, Delson, you know, I just realized all the DUPs have concrete powers, right? So, hey, all you have to do is drain one of them and we can go home. If it doesn't work, it will mean you were wrong about that, huh? Then we can still go home.
about you, big fella? No time to check, man. I got dupes coming at me from every direction. Get the hell out of there. Yeah, great advice. your besties in blue know anything about these core relays? Yeah, well, apparently they've got them set up all over town. Seattle PD's been can find out where they all are. Sure. Like I said. Good. I need you to send the locations to my phone. What? So you can keep tapping them for more powers? No. Forget it. Wow. My own brother wants me to fight the ultra-mega bioterrorist of all... Time with less powers. Look, I didn't say that. Well, I guess I shouldn't put it off then. Better go straight on to Augustine now and get it over with. Not sure what's gonna happen. All right, all right, I get it. Look, just stay away from Augustine and I'll send you the ones I know of. Thanks, Reg. You're the best brother ever. <laughs> no, the best brother ever would have locked you in a closet back in Salmon Bay for the rest of your life. Wow. I'm sure a closet can hold a conduit for long, but I appreciate your wanting to lock me up. Man, how many DUP guys are in this city? Yeah, well, luckily you have the advantage in numbers, my man. Uh, how do you figure that? Well, because one person can move around faster, lighter, quieter. Plus, it'll make them a better Not gonna know what hit him. Why, spoil the surprise when it happens? <laughs> Good point. Checkpoints and cameras on just about every corner. That's the benefit of having home field advantage. Except this isn't their home field. Try telling them that. Okay, so that way is not an option. It's better work. <laughs> ah, 
thing was awesome. It freaking worked. I gotta tell you, man, I think at the rate I'm going with the powers thing, I'm like one, maybe two away from storming her castle. Okay, why don't we slow down there, hotshot? I mean, she just destroyed an entire concrete and steel bridge, remember? Right, so you're thinking one more's not gonna do it. That's what I'm thinking. You think the DUP does this to every town they get called to? Apparently, that's what they say. Why do people even put up with that? Because when it comes down to it, most folks aren't willing to trade life for liberty or the pursuit of happiness. Uh... Reg, you should see this, man. The DUP's completely trashed this city. All the people are walking hunched over and nervous looking. Yeah, well, that's how martial law works. Control the city and the people by breaking them both down first. Yeah, well, occupying armies suck. You may want to keep that to yourself for now. Bro and tired. Hey, Reg, those uh, core relays we saw on the way here must have been cracked by all that destruction. This one's sealed up pretty tight. I doubt the DUP is going to let you borrow their keys. You're probably going to have to break them open. You guys just happen to have some mad new breaking skills. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Look out below! You want to see it again? I tell you, man, I think at the rate I'm going with the powers thing, I'm like one, maybe two.